All right, welcome back. This is M Dog. Here we are at uh, probably my favorite map overall of the ones that I've been able to play so far, which is the France map. And uh, it's such a big map. It kind of reminds you of Amber Lake at, in Russian Fishing Ford, just in the sense that it's so big. No matter how much time you spent here, there's probably plenty of spots you've never fished before. And we'll take a look at, at the map here once we get some fish in. As you can see, we have the boat here right by us. So if we hit a nice sized carp, we can just go cut the uh, fish fight down to a little less time by chasing it. I think this is gonna be another nice golden carp. So this is why I like fishing out in this area in particular. Because a large golden carp like this one can get you close to or more than 3000 XP, uh, which really adds up in terms of leveling up and all that. So let's see what's on our first line. Our second and third line are identical in terms of the uh, ground bait and boilies we're using. But this one, I'm doing something a little different. We're actually using a technoplankton kind of bait, chocolate flavored, which should be really good for leather carp. However, I'm not sure that there are as many, if any, leather carp out here. We'll find out what this is. The leather carp might be on another part of the lake or actually a different lake altogether. And I'll show you what I mean by a different lake altogether when we look at the map here. This is the biggest lake on the property. And this is the only one where you can use your boat. But this is also the only lake large enough that you would theoretically get spooled on. The other two lakes, which the other two actually might be connected because there's a walking bridge that sort of goes in between the two. Um, but they do still feel like two, two distinct lakes in a sense. One is pretty small and the other one is kind of the medium size area. See, I think this might be another golden carp, which is fine if it is. We can keep fishing for golden carp. But when I put this bait and uh, ground bait combination together, I was really more trying to target leather carp. So if we want to do that, we may have to go to uh, the other lake on the property. Which we only have three of these baits left, so we'd have to get some more anyway. Yep, over 3,000 XP for that large gold, golden carp. So this bait combination is catching the golden carp out here as well. So far we've had one carp and the rest golden carp in this spot, which the golden carp are just such good experience still only one hero star all right so let's look and see what we're using on this first one we do have the chocolate baits here a uh, carp honey ground bait with alpine honey potato cube and brown boilies mixed in um, so yeah that seems to be working again for the golden carp but this is what we were trying to target the golden carp with and that's tiger boilies which i really like sorry tiger nut boilies which i really like out here a little bit different ground bait combination here, similar, but honey, uh, alpine honey, uh, pearl barley, and brown boilies in this mix. But it all seems to be working pretty well. And um, yeah, you just make really nice silver out here. So let's look at the map. I mean, you can see how big this, <laughs> this lake is. And I, I mean, there's so much of this lake I haven't fished of the larger one. Where you spawn in is over here. So you've kind of got, so I guess these are two separate water bodies. This is the smaller, almost like a pond. Um, a lot of people, I think, match rod, uh, float fish for grass carp and stuff over here. And then this is a little bit bigger um, right here near the dock. I think there's some nice leather carp maybe in here or out here. And um, when France first came out, I believe it was just this part, and then eventually he added this big lake, if I'm not mistaken. One thing that's nice is if you do fill up your 
keep net, you can go sell your fish right here. So you just have to take the boat over to the dock, but you don't have to go all the way back to the starting area, which is kind of nice. So let's see if we can get one more fish out here for you. And this is sort of, like I said before, I mean, grass pike happens to be the daily today. So I'm just ignoring that. You make so much silver and XP on the uh, carp that the um oh here's a grass carp experience order so that'd be nice you could do that with the float fishing but anyway the the dailies i think they can still be good but at the higher level lakes and and stuff it seems like there are just such good uh, fish you can catch that you can make more xp and money by just targeting what's lucrative to target basically So it's about 4.22 a.m., still a little dark. But we should have, I mean, we've already had a good bite rate. I mean, these have just been one big carp after another. But we should have, once sun comes up, we should have an even better bite rate. But this is one of those spots, like if I was going to, you know, if you really want to just kind of sit and grind on Fisher Online, this would be a spot to do it. Just in doing, I think we were less than 28 and a half, somewhere down here or something. Just in doing the dailies and a little bit of fishing I've done to increase this and to do this video, we've really gotten a lot of XP today. It's been quite nice. All right, this is a smaller one. Certainly don't need the boat for this one. I don't think this will be big enough to count as a large... Uh, this will be a regular sized carp or golden carp, most likely. Oh, let's take a look at what fish are on this lake. There's a lot of different fish. In fact, there's bass here even. Um, so even even though this, I think of this as a big carp lake, there's just so much, so many different types of fishing. There's several types of catfish here, I believe, two or three. Um, yeah, it's just a regular carp there. Okay, fish on the lake. Look at all these. And there's fish that I haven't even caught. Some of these fish haven't been in the game. That I mean, I think he's added some stuff to this since I even fished here last. So we have albino wells as well as the um, regular wells catfish. So we have wells catfish, channel catfish, al wells albino. And then we also have all these different. So in terms of carp, we've got leather carp, grass carp, mirror carp, silver carp motley. Yeah, there's the black bass and the smallmouth bass. Um, and the golden carp. So those are the different carp species, quite a few. Mm, yeah, again, not too big. be slightly bigger than that last one but not the size we're hoping for I can't tell is that a golden one no I don't think it is that is a leather carp so that's our first leather out here and it's not big enough for the uh, income quest that we picked up so there are leathers out here. That's good to know. So maybe we will get lucky and uh, hit a big leather on our first rod with the chocolate bait. Yeah, some of that could have been time of day because I guess when we started it was nighttime and maybe the golden carps are pretty active at night. I'm not sure.
So we're at France. Technically next is Netherlands. I'm trying to remember Netherlands. That might be the... Yeah, I think that's the one where you can... Um, it's kind of like a sea map. That one's pretty good. It's pretty different. It's kind of the first sea map. And then you have Italy, which I like Italy a lot. It's uh, really fun for um, actually trolling. I like trolling Italy. So that would be a fun video to show kind of the trolling. I don't know how much has changed. And I guess at level 28, you can go to the Danube. And I'm not sure that I've fished there. If I have, not much. And then that's the last. Oh, wait, there's also 26. So I might be getting confused. Finland might be the one that I like trolling. I guess we'll just have to go and see. I'm kind of getting confused on these different maps. Okay, so we've got Netherlands, Italy, and then Finland. And then Serbia is the most recent map I've unlocked. But I don't know that I've fished there, if, 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 if at all, not much. Oh, and then there's also the DLC map that I guess we can check out at some point. And then I'll have to look again, but it's possible that once we hit 30, I might have access to another, another map. The other cool thing he does is as you finish dailies and collect those tokens, you can actually use tokens to travel to maps that you haven't unlocked yet. So um, you can do a little fishing at higher level places even before you unlock them, which is kind of a nice feature, I think. There's a nice golden carp. Is that gonna be large? Yeah, 2,700 XP. That was on the chocolate. Oh. Uh, I don't know. Actually, we might not need the boat for that, but just in case, we'll... we'll try to get it a little faster. Well, it looks like it had really sw been swimming towards us here. Oh, yeah. Okay, it's another leather. A little small, but it is another leather. leather. Alright, let's look at that travel map again. So yes, yeah, Siberia, this is the DLC one. And Serbia is the one at 28. Is there also a level 30 map? Yep, nope. Yes, there is. Iron, uh, sorry, Iran, Caspian Sea. So I've never been there before. And then you have Scotland at 34. I've never been there. Of course, Norway at 37. I have not been there either. So some maps I've never been to. And uh, we've got one DLC map, and it looks like fairly soon coming out with a USA map for a second DLC map. So lots to see and do. Okay, let's see if we can get one more carp here before we wrap this video up. You get the idea, but really, um, you know, if you're into carp fishing, it doesn't get much better in this game at least than, um, than the France map here, that I've seen at least.
Sorry, did not know I had myself muted. This seems like a pretty nice sized carp. So I don't know if you saw me interacting with the map. I actually didn't know that feature was in the game now, but that is pretty cool. You can make your own labels there. Someone in chat had said something about 99131 being good for grass pike. So I was testing to see how the, uh, if that worked and it did. So that's pretty sweet. But let's see what we have on here. Man, that looks like a nice carp, doesn't it? I think that's going to be a decent little leather. Leathers get so big, but I think this will be a not not too new, not too shabby one. Whoa! We can put enough pressure on him to get him up towards the surface, but it's hard to keep him there. He's also swimming at like different speeds. <laughs> so, uh, it's a little awkward. All right. He doesn't change directions here. I think we'll be able to. Oh, he just got out there. Yeah, this is a nice little carp. And I am not at all sure what type of carp it is. It sort of has an elongated body. It's not as fat looking as I would expect that's one of those that might be one of those motley which I don't think for the size that those are is worth as much the silver motley or whatever I don't think it's a grass carp but it might be one of those silver motleys okay slow down pull him up oof yeah that's what it is He's a bit of a booger. Every time he comes up, he's like swimming away and up. So we've not been able to. Land him in those moments. Change direction on us again. There we go. Oh, nope, not quite. Mm. Tell you what. I think these get really big too though, so I'm not even sure it's that big of one, but we'll check once we get him in kind of where we are on the relative size for these fellas. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's kind of like a whale. I mean, that's what I feel like right now. He's just sort of manhandling us. I 
it's right there. Oh my goodness. Okay, 25 kilo large silver carp motley, but see only 1500 XP. I mean, for that size, some of the other species would be way more than that, but let's see how big those get. Uh, let's just go check our lines real quick, make sure we don't have something else going on. Uh, record silver carp motley, 42 kilos. Yikes. Yeah, that was, that guy was big, but nothing compared to the record. All right, are any of these lines? Oh yeah. Ooh. All right, let's get this one. I don't know if the other one will still be on there, but let's get these as quick as we can. Oh, that looks like a golden carp. Very nice. Just a little one. We'll take it. Almost 2,700 experience for that little guy. So I think I'm right. That was more experience than the 25 kilo, the other one. All right, so this does not have anything on it. If it ever did, it, it I think it just came off. All right. So let's do go back to home base. We'll go ahead and cancel that one quest. And see how we did. Yeah, 778 silver. I mean, so that's, you know, in just a few fish, a lot of silver for this game. And that, that does sell really well. That's our best selling fish. So it may not be the most experienced, but it was a very good selling fish. But look at these large golden carps. Not only there was so much XP, but the silver really adds up on them. Very nice. And I still don't think we've gotten a second hero star. We haven't, that is amazing. Okay, well there's France. And again, this is, by the way, this is the other, you know, these two lakes down here. Um, and this is where I've caught some leather carp before, just kind of in this area. All right. As always, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.